thyroid and tonsil both of these are important tissues of our body and both of them are situated in our neck region but are they same or they are different do you know that if not let's discuss that namaste i am your host dr tanvi mayur patel endocrinologist that is a hormone specialist doctor from mumbai india in my previous video we discussed about detailed anatomy of the thyroid gland in that comment section i received few comments which asked me doctor is this same as a thyroid is it same as a tonsil answer is no and so we decided to make this video for you so let's understand tonsil first so the tonsil is a part of a lymphoid tissue now what is a lymphoid tissue it is a special kind of a tissue which has a very important role to play in our immune system well our main primary immune system is located in our bone marrow but besides that there are secondary lymphoid tissues and your tonsil is one of it now what does this tonsil do now these tonsils helps in our immune protection now these tonsils by the way there are four different types of the tonsils and what are they the very first one is a pharyngeal tonsil second one is a palatine tonsil third is a tubal tonsil and the fourth one is a lingual tonsil when anyone has a tonsil infection we usually pertain that to pharyngeal tonsils now so these tonsils they increase in size till we are 5 years of age after around 7 years of age they starts reducing in their size and by the time we are around 10 to 12 years of age this tonsil is usually disappeared okay and they undergo into a shrinkage now so usually when a children have this infection it is this pharyngeal tonsil infection now on the tonsil the surface of the tonsil cell has a very specialized cell called as a m cell now what do they do so the whenever we are eating any food or whenever inhaling any air and if that food or air has any micro organism which has a power to give us an infection then the moment they enter into our body these m cells get alert and active and they indirectly give a signal to our immunity cells that is a b cell and a t cell and both of them they fight with this uh, microorganism and that's how we are protected and we don't get any infection so that's how the tonsils play a very important role in our immune system whereas now let's talk about the thyroid thyroid we have only one in number and this thyroid gland is an endocrine gland now endocrine glands are the one who has a power to secrete a special chemical called as a hormone and these hormones are secreted inside the blood now we have one beautiful butterfly shaped gland which is a also called as a h shaped gland and this thyroid gland are usually one in number and where are they situated they are situated inside our neck region in our neck region we've got a windpipe also called as a trachea so just in front of this trachea this thyroid gland is situated now this thyroid gland secretes two important hormone called as a t3 and a t4 hormone both of these hormones they control our general body metabolisms besides that your thyroid also makes another hormone called as a calcitonin which controls our calcium level in our body and that will indirectly help in our bone development also so though thyroid and the tonsils are in our neck region they do not have any similarities with each other all right if you have got any good information after watching this video please click on the like button and if you want to watch more hormones related video like a diabetes thyroid hormones you can subscribe to my channel and if you click on the bell icon you will be notified the moment i will upload a new video and if you want to have any paid consultation the number is mentioned in the description box and my staff will help you for that
Thank you for joining me till now and I wish you great health. Take care till we meet again in our next video. Till then, Namaste.